everybody goldie here and we are running it back with stacy keebler super stacy uh this preview is going to use um gooker sorry if that makes anybody upset um and snoop if you have neither and you roll up into my comments saying well i don't have them lucky for you i have a video without them so i encourage you to watch that and leave your negative ass out of my comments um so we are going to do some red move focusing. I'm going to start with the three star build uh, the finisher, the Keebler kick, 10 MP, deal 403,201 damage, and gain nine green MP. We're going to run this alongside the straight jacket choke and the cartwheel escape. Not going to bother using this move at all, it's just there for aesthetic. Uh, we're going to use the sub to charge the finisher and charge back and forth but no five gold opponents on the road means we don't need to recycle so cover your eyes uh steel for more green mp batista for 50 percent more red move damage snoop for 25 percent more red move damage and gooker for 25 percent move damage to all colors and we have swapped the belt to a takedown belt for this. So set bonus is going to give us 30% more. And I have a level 14 out of 15. So we're missing 20% here. Uh, couldn't do it. Couldn't risk the, the minimal um, metal bits I have. But we got it up to 113. And... They have move defense. Yes, they do. So let's um let's see what this is gonna do in a match. Look over there, an enemy, super Stacy to the rescue. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Can I do voiceovers for this game? Do you think they'll let me? Purpo, hit me up. Um. Okay. So. Two, three matches is all we're going to need. I have max tour perks, so this is ready to go on turn one. I don't even care about doing the damage. Go ahead and kick out. See if I care. That little glitch thing is, uh, felt like the zombie Asuka gear glitch where everything just gets all shaky. Anyways, uh, the finisher is doing 1.3 million damage. So that's how that looks. Um, with the superhero tag link, you can add an extra 20% onto that. The tag matches on the road are abysmal, so I'm not going to bother because there's just, it's not even fair. There's nothing adequate to show. Uh, please, for the love of God, add five gold female opponents and some mixed tags um, so we can do proper previews. Um, anyways. That is the three-star build. Let's go ahead and take a look at the five-star build for this. Five-star move is the corner stomps. We're going to bring that in with yellow one and red two. So yellow one ground stomps six MP, deal 73,091 damage, and choose eight gems to destroy. Red two corner foot choke nine MP, deal 168,109 damage, and force your opponents to skip their turn for one turn. And red three corner stomps, eight MP, deal 95,139 damage, and choose seven gems to make into yellow gems. Uh, so this would be if you are attempting to do a stun lock build. Again, Gooker and Snoop. Uh, Kofi for more yellow MP, Batista for some more red move damage. Keeping the takedown, keeping the red percent. Uh, but this should help speed things up a little bit. Uh, Damage wise, with the stun lock, just do a little more red move damage and get the match over with quicker. So, General's Orders Plate is going to help us recycle here. We need at least, we need four. Okay. Let's 
let's just do that. So now the stun move is doing upwards of half a mil. And the corner stomps is doing just over 300k. Love this move. They just gave her the mud hole stomp. They're like, F it. Just recycle the move. We don't even care. She's got legs. The cascade boo and uh we didn't play that very well did we oh well sorry i was distracted by her having the stone cold steve austin flip in the bird um okay we need a lot of reds we're just gonna take them all rip. I did that wrong too. Professional um, content creator here. Uh, let's just get some loot. There, kick out of three. I dare you. Meh. Can't say no to that. So if you were playing this better, which I assume most people could, um, you would try to maintain the stun lock, take advantage of the general's orders play, try to see if you can destroy some yellow and, I'm uh, sorry, it's not some yellow, some red gems with this, or at least set yourself up some five matches to, you know, help you recycle a little easier. But with an ideal coach setup, you can do, you know, like we were doing almost a 600k on the stun move. So it just helps speed things along. There's one more build I want to take a look at um, with the takedown set. So let's go ahead and give that one a look. Last build I want to take a look at is the four star build. And this is the one with the beefy one MP move. Um, so we're going to run the ground stomps, which is yellow one, the corner foot choke, which is red two, and the roundhouse kick, which is yellow two, one MP, deal 246,810 damage and make 11 random multiply gems into blast gems. Now, we're not really using this to get the blast gems. We're using this just because the move damage is so high for a one MP move. We should be able to hit it a couple times a turn, depending on where the pin bar is. Um, so the entourage for this, we're bringing in Showboat Biggie, we're keeping Gooker, we're keeping Snoop just because we have him and we're flexing. Um, but for this build, we are bringing in the big boy. We are bringing in the 200% metal. Rest in peace to Icon Batista, who I never use anymore. Um, but yeah, that's going to make this move hit for a million damage. <laughs> so... You know, again, five-star gold opponent would be super nice in this case just to reflect. Um, just to accurately show how easily you can melt the health, but whatever. We'll just, we'll have to deal with it on turn one. For us, turn one win. So she does have a little bit of move defense, so it's not quite a million damage. I know, you can get your money back at the door. Um, let's do that. And then eight to destroy. I mean, we can do this. Here, let's let's cheese it. Let's absolutely cheese it. We're just gonna do the one. We're gonna do the roundhouse kick again. And then we're just gonna swipe our way out of here. Good night, Nikki. Again, if you have a Hall of Fame Andre or Hall of Fame Rick Rude to use instead of Snoop, you could get that yellow move um, even higher. 
but yeah. Bird's the word. Y'all didn't think I would go through the preview and not say that, right? Uh, let's do a quick little conclusion. So that concludes our run it back of Stacy Keebler, Super Stacy. And I just want to take a quick look at the options for move damage um, that I don't have. So it would be Tech Priest for the finisher if you go finish your build for 150%. And then Snoop we have, Googer we have, but for yellow move damage. Um, so Hall of Fame Rick Rude is 25%. Uh, Dawkins, if you don't have Snoop, Dawkins gives you 10% as well. Um, and then Hall of Fame Andre gives you 10% and an extra destroy. So those would be your options for move damage. Again, the superheroes tag link, which I hope gets an actual graphic at some point, um, will give you an extra 20%. Right now, currently, that is only with Hurricane. Uh, so that overrides their Ruthless Aggression link, but... I feel like it's worth it for the 20%. And uh, yeah, that's Run It Back with Super Stacy. Let me know in the comments what you think of the uh, builds with the move damage. How would you run her, etc. cetera. And uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for being a friend. Yeah.